Hey everybody, it's Becky. How are you today? Um, I have got a unboxing to do from Craftably. I did get to order the last diamond painting from their site that I really, really wanted. Um, so I wanted to share that with you all. Um, you probably already know the standard tray um, multi-placers, tweezers, all that with the uh, Craftably. So our questions are always going to be what do we have as far as washi tapes? Um, so of course there's also the little canister of wax. And then of course, what is our cover minder on this one? Uh, looks like a duplicate for me. I've got this one. Um, just trying to get the tape off of here so I can show you all. Uh, you might notice that I'm in a little bit different lighting today. Um, I didn't want to move all the stuff off of a dreamy retreat and move it out of the way to be able to do this unboxing. Um, so I went ahead and I'm just, I'm out in my um, sewing room. Um, the one that I'm going to eventually move my sewing room into uh, because a friend of mine has been over the last couple of days and her and I've been sewing together, so... Um, so here is the cover minder that I have, which just has two little double magnets on the back so that you can hold the plastic covers back. And they come in these nifty little cases. And then for washi tape, we got a little orange and white wave. And... I'm going to peel this one off a little bit so we can see the design more. Cute little colorful trees. Alrighty. So that's what we got in our little goodie bag for this canvas. Tuck these away real quick. Alright. So this particular painting is square. It's a 32 inch by 24 inch. So keep in mind if you're following along with a dreamy retreat, it's 42 inches by 24 inches. So this way it's the same, but this way it's a little shorter by 10 inches. 10 inches is a lot. That's, that's a lot. All right, so we have 72 colors. Um, this one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten AB colors, one, two, three, four LZs. Let me show you that sticker sheet here. So, with craftably, and pardon my shadows, like I said, I'm in a different room, so my lighting's different. So, we have the LZs, which are uh, crystal rhinestones. And then up here we have all of these AB colors. This is going to be a super shiny, happy, fun canvas. And the name of it, because you guys already saw, Sunken Treasure. And it is by Gino Peoples. I'll give you a better shot of that here in a little bit where we're not getting so much shadowing. All right, let's take a look at the drills real quick before we get into the canvas. Let me see if I can swing things around here and maybe make it a little less awkward. I do have a lamp that I can hook up if we need to. Uh, I may end up doing that to kind of show off the drills a little bit. So lots and lots of colors. I see some ABs in there sparkling. That looks like the same color AB in all four of those packets. And it looks like one of our LZs is in there. There's another AB right there. So let's open these up and take a peek. So for those of you who are following along with Craftably and their 
unfortunate closing. Um, you might take a peek. I think they've got four canvases left on their website right now. Um, the canvases themselves are not marked down at all. Um, however, um, you know, they are, you know, trying to kind of build up some funds to pay off, you know, the debts that they have. So if you're able to support them, that would be great. They do have some, um, some of their accessories have started to go on a little bit of a sale. So yeah, all four of those packets right there are the same sparkly blue. Look at all those colors in that AB. Those are so pretty. And then we have a green AB. Like I said, this is square. And another green AB, are those the same? Nope, number 71 is 904 and 905 is 72. Let's see here. And these are the rest of our ABs. Like I said, I believe there was 10 of them I counted. So we've got like a lighter orange and a medium orange. Um, one of the accessories that they have listed on there that I may end up eventually going back and getting if I get a chance to. It's not like a, oh, I have to have it kind of a thing. Um, they do have a generic brand of the Elizabeth Ward style containers. But the one that they have, DP Crazy Lady, check out that purple. We've got a light purple and a medium purple. Yeah. Both of these packs here are the same color, so we're going to have lots of that purple in there. Anyways, it's an Elizabeth Ward style container, but it only comes with one size of containers in it, the medium size. Um, and so I, in order to really use that system the way it's designed to, I would need to order you know, another set that's got a variety of sizes of containers in it. Um, and I just, I'm not 100% sold on that. So again, I may order it to, um, you know, to support their business. Um, but I don't think I'll, I don't know. I still haven't decided. So um, if it's, when I'm ready to order it, if it's still there, then it's meant to be. And if it's not there, then it wasn't meant to be. So um, these are the LZ crystals. Um, if you've not been watching a dreamy retreat, you may not be familiar with these. Um, the silver side is the flat side that goes down on your canvas. And then you can kind of see there's like a, like a red on the other side. We may be able to see that better on some of the other drills. Like this has like a, a golden color on one side. We've got another train of LZs coming up here. So there's another kind of golden color. You see this a lot better. You see the pink side is the is the pretty side that you see on the painting, and the silver side goes back on the adhesive. And now we're into the standard drills. So the advantage with the Elizabeth Ward style containers, which I've not used, so I don't have any personal experience with, um, but packets like this that just have a tiny bit in, they have like extra small containers, and then they have small containers, medium containers, large, and extra large. So, you know, whereas this, you might only need a teeny tiny container when you're looking at having you know, one of these big monstrosity packages or maybe even two of them in the extra large containers. And then you can just put them in, stack them in the, uh, the case. Um, and you're able to organize them by that instead of having the same size container over your whole thing. We've got a little hitchhiker in there. Now we're getting into some more pretty blue colors. I just love that gradient there where you've got the three different shades. That's really pretty. 
All right, the famous 939s. Looks like we've got three packages of those, and they look black on camera. Um, I don't know if I can get it to show its true color. These are super shiny, but they are not ABs. They are just standard drills. These are like a super dark blue uh, is what 939 is. And like I said, that you really can't see that through the package, but let's see, and we're getting into like a forest green type color more oranges, brown, really pretty like dark carnation pink, really pretty dark emerald green, kind of a fuddy-duddy brown, and another really pretty blue. Those, those two colors look very, very similar. I was looking to see if they were the same, but they are not. All right, there is our first package of drills. Um, it's very common for Craftably to put two sets of drills on these big paintings. Um, and I also love that they do the picture of the painting on the color, in color on the um drills so that if you have any questions on you know what what set this goes with you can easily match those up looking I don't know what that little symbol is maybe oh that okay it's representing the fact that these are square drills okay so like I said it's a 32 by 24 like an oceanscape scene See what we've got here and I'm not showing these in any particular number order I'm just showing them and they'll just go back in the little packets the way they the way they end up so um, I think of what else I'd like to talk about with Craftedly. Um, like I said, I'm really sad that I, I've just gotten to the point where I can order from them and they're going out. I really do hope that Michael and Amy are at peace with the, with the decision to close down the company and um, I hope that they end up moving on to bigger and better things. They, they are wonderful people and they deserve the absolute best in life. So hopefully that's what comes for them at this point. Got some more pretty blues. Now I feel like I'm going backwards here. That's a really pretty color. What's that one? That's 809. That's pretty. That's like a really dark turquoise. So the DMC code on it is 803. Yeah, looks like a little hitchhiker in there. I don't worry too much about hitchhikers. They come out pretty easily once you uh, open up your packets. And, you know, when there's that big of a drastic difference in them between, where was that guy? Right there. You know, he's a very brown tan color you're not going to just accidentally pick that one up without noticing lots more blues really pretty dark blue there 977 that's a really pretty coral color um, some of the other accessories that I've seen on their website, besides the, uh, the storage container, um, they do have some metal tips. Have any of you used the metal tips from, uh, from Craftably? Um, I've got a set of the metal tips 
from Diamond Art Club that Granny, Lazy Retired Granny had sent me. Um, and they are, they're really wide and really heavy um, and not super comfortable to work with. Um, and so I don't know if the ones that Craftably has are that same way or not. So if you've used theirs, let me know. Um, I can't remember if they have any pens left. I know they did carry pens at one point in time. It's a pretty mauve color. More purples and pinky purple. Nice little peachy, fleshy tone type. Um, I know they do have some of the large trays. Um, like what I have that I use sometimes work with that large white tray. Oh, there's our one little bag of three tens. Um, and I think those were on sale. Um, so definitely go check out Craftably's website. They have, like I said, when I looked earlier today, they had four paintings left. They did still have Sunken Treasure, this one that we're looking at now. Um, they still had that one in stock. Um, and then they have another, like, really pretty purple and blue beach scene. Um, and then they have a couple of um, Christmassy ones. Um, one with a Santa and a snowman. And then one with, I think, just a snowman standing in a doorway kind of situation. Um, goodness, we've got a lot of these as well. Seven ninety seven. That was... Did we already end with that one? I thought we did. Yeah, we've got two packs of $7.97 for sure. And I thought I had seen that color in here before already, but maybe not. Um, and so if you uh, if you want to snag any craftably paintings, like I said, they're down to their last four in stock. So be sure to run over there and see if any of them jump out at you. That is the color scheme. I'm going to kind of pan over these real quick. So I think this is going to be a really, really pretty bright picture. I think it's going to be a lot of fun to work on. All right. And bear with me, I'm gonna put all these drills up and then we're gonna flip over the canvas and take a look at the canvas itself. I am in no way, shape or form a professional drill packager. So these will probably not go back in the way they came out. And I'm honestly okay with that. We'll just do the best we can. Not too shabby. And then this one that's got all our special drills in it. I can't believe how pretty these AB drills are. I'm so excited to see where these go on the canvas. Let's see here. I feel like that's not right. You okay there? Sorry, you just like totally did a full-on flip there. All right, come on, camera. Quit being so dramatic. I'll set you off to the sidewalk with these drills up here. I feel like this one's not going to go as smoothly as the other one did. 
especially after you guys did a somersault on me. Oh, come on now. Almost there. So close. Yes, yeah, so far away. Okay. Good enough. Good enough. All right, now bear with me while we get this flipped over. Which way is the right way? That way. And you can see my uh, my friend's sewing machine set up here and mine there and like way too many stuffed animals. Uh, this this room still needs a lot of work before it's ready to uh, have full-time occupancy in it. So um, I think I'm going to go ahead and pick you guys up so you can see. So here we are. We've got some birds up in the sky, some mountains in the background. We come down here and there's a conch shell and a treasure chest. We've got a pair of dolphins there. A little barrel of probably some treasure spilled out there with a little angelfish. Let's see, looks like these are going to be more angel fish and maybe a couple anglers or parrot fish. Some really pretty coral. Oh, there is a sailboat right here. I hadn't noticed the sailboat. So there it is. Let's see. That's number 72. See if we can see that symbol here. I'm sorry, I've got, like I said, I've got really poor lighting here. Cannot quite tell what that symbol is. But I'm sure we can find it on here. There's that really pretty sparkly blue. Maybe our sticker sheet will have a better. Okay, so it's like a, where is it on here? A circle with a line through it. Yep, that's easier to see. Was that that pretty blue one? That number 70 is what we're looking for. So 70, much easier to see is a half circle. All right, I'm going to take you out of the holder, see if we can get a little bit better look here. All right, so you see these little half circles all along here. Those are all going to be that really pretty AB drill that we've got four packages of. So it's just going to be all along in that water column. see here so where is that other a b that has the circle with the line through it maybe up here on the mountain not i'm not seeing that one right off i'm sure we'll find it as we get through to working the canvas Let's see here, some other ABs. We've got this little biohazard symbol. Our LZs are like a little anchor and like a little four square patch thing.
let's see. So yeah, it looks like right here, some of the LZs along in here. This little symbol right here is an AB as well. We'll have some more of that blue AB right in here. Yeah, I'm very much looking forward to this. Um, I do not have a plan as to when I will start it. Um, I don't have much of a plan on when I will do what in this particular year. Um, but that is my newest painting. I know I said I was going to do a low buy year this year, um, but apparently I'm doing all my buying in the beginning of the year. Hopefully the rest of the year can be a low buy um, doesn't seem to be working out that way for me right now. Um, but I've loved everything I've gotten. Like I said, I didn't want to miss out on any more craftably paintings than I had to. Um, there are some that sold out before I got to them. Um, I may end up with those in a D stash at some point in time. You, know, you just never know, uh, what's going to jump out at me as I am shopping so, but yeah, uh, if you have any questions on this one, just give me a holler. Let me know what you think of it, what questions you have. And we will talk to you guys another time. I will give you guys an update, hopefully fairly soon, on a dreamy retreat. I'm actually going to go work on that now while this is uploading. Um... I won't do a, a whip and chat on it right at the moment just for a simple fact that I don't have anything really to talk about. So um, I will talk to you guys next time and I'll give you an update on a dreamy retreat here in the next couple of days, hopefully. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.